is wait is it recording i don't even i always have to check because you know no i i've recorded videos before where like i i do the whole thing and then it didn't even record and so i'm like paranoid now anyway hello friends welcome back to my channel it's Looney here today and today i'm really excited to make this video because there's like a lot of like negativity in some of the communities in star stable and so today i'm going to be reading your most heartwarming moments in real life and on star stable if you guys want to be involved in any of my videos in the future go ahead and follow my Instagram at lunazebraforest. I post a lot of fun art on there and other Star Stable content, so go ahead and check that out if you guys are interested. And being in videos is always fun, so I ask once in a while, make sure you keep those story notifications on so you guys are always involved. But yeah, to start off this video, I'm actually going to be reading some of your mail because I think we have two to read and I always love doing that. Okay, actually, apparently those males were not video content. So since this horse is actually at level 15, we're going to go back to our home stable and quickly switch out this horse um, so we can actually get good training done, you know? Okay, who is our closest to level 15? Hmm. Hmm. I feel like I really want to train Hope today, maybe, but I don't know for sure. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're gonna go train Hope today because she's level 7 and she is such a cute little horse. So we are going to go ahead and do that. Also, I was meaning to buy Star Coins on the Double Star Queen weekend, but I was just so busy. So we missed our opportunity and I'm kind of bummed about that because I was gonna do some fun videos with it. But I guess I'll have to wait for the next Double Star Queen weekend. Okay, now that we're on Hope, I guess we can go ahead and start our training. So we're going to start somewhere where we don't really start which i guess would have to be i mean i start everywhere so we're gonna actually okay we're gonna go to dino valley because we can actually do it with this horse and that's that's pretty pretty exciting so nick stone grounds camp oh my goodness gracious what is hello sorry i was just wrestling with a pillow so Hope that makes you guys happy, I guess. Okay. Okay, so we're here and I'm gonna go ahead and start reading the questions as soon as we get to the race. Also, right, actually, before I start the questions, I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm so sorry for the lack of like interesting content, I guess, in my last couple of videos. Um, it's just because I've been extremely busy and haven't really had a lot of inspiration. So if you guys, I asked this in my last video, but if you have any ideas of videos you guys want me to do, um, please comment them down below. That will help a lot. And if I'm ever in need of any ideas, then I'll go ahead and check there uh, for sure. And I'll credit you. So thanks for that. And now we can start reading our most heartwarming moments in real life and on Star Stable. So our first response is when my bunny started to trust me. Oh, that's so cute. I love animals so much. And it some of them take a long time before they can like finally warm up to you and it's just the best feeling ever. I haven't had a lot of like huge pets, but I do ride horses and I know it's the best feeling when a horse like really likes to be around you and it's just it's just so sweet and yeah, that's for sure a heartwarming moment. I bet that felt really really good. I forgot what I was going to say. Okay, I guess we're I guess we're moving on because I lost my train of thought. It just went out the window. Um, one was a boy told me I was good looking. <laughs> it's actually, is this true? I mean, this is for sure true. I'm pretty sure. But like, it means a lot when, I mean, if, if guys compliment anything about you, it means so much more than if like a girl compliments you. It's just like, I'm not saying this for everybody. I'm like, I can't even, I can't even speak right now. I'm sorry. But it means so much if a guy tells you anything or like if you get a guy's opinion because you know they're going to be honest with you and actually say like what they think. Well, some girls will just kind of say what you, they think you want to hear, which I don't know. I don't know why they do that. Girls are confusing sometimes. But, but yeah, that probably meant a lot for sure and I bet that felt really good. I had somebody compliment me on my jeans today and I was like, oh yeah, some nice like dark, dark blue jeans. So I guess, I guess they were cute, you know, I don't, 
I don't really know. Uh, but yeah, it felt great. It was actually kind of an awkward situation, to be honest, because I was like carrying a chair over my head because I had to like bring it to my desk or whatever. And she's like, oh my gosh, I love your jeans. I was like, thanks. And I almost like tripped over a backpack <laughs> with this big chair above my head. It was just like, it was just not the best. I am so mad at this saddle. Like, look, <laughs> look at it. It's like digging into the blanket. This is, I just, can I sue Star Stable? Like, hashtag bring back our good saddles. I love how just like, I, I did a hashtag with my hands, but like no one could see it. So I don't know why I was doing it. Um super smart of me um our next response is you texted me yeah I, i'm sure that was the highlight of your day right there i'm sure you just oh <laughs> excuse me uh, excuse me uh, <laughs> the logs are out to get me i just can they can i just like calm down for a second for like a minute maybe just like a day i would i would love that but yeah i'm 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 pretty great so that probably felt fantastic <laughs> how did i why did i think i i could jump that i just i don't know i don't really know our next response was i was being made fun of by somebody during the end of a champ and somebody from my that person's club defended me and left we're still best friends oh my gosh that's the sweetest thing ever the people who are really there for you in the toughest situations are the people you you have to like keep in touch with because those are like the true friends because if they're not there to defend you in like moments when you're like having trouble then they they shouldn't be uh, in your life i guess because you always want somebody you can def depend on and i'm glad you found that person that that probably felt so great to have a friend like that being able to like leave that club when you know it's not good just to help somebody else that that was great <laughs> that was probably so sweet you probably appreciated that i don't know how to end this sentence but um <laughs> Oh, I just want to, before I read my next response, I want to get you guys' opinion on this horse right here. So look at how cute it is. I love the North Swedish horses, and I absolutely love the marking on this one. And it's so adorable. Like, look at how cute it is. And they're cheap, so like, bonus points for them. So I've, I've been really liking this horse for a long time. So yeah, give me your opinion in the comments if I should buy this or not, because I don't know. I don't know if I should spend my star coins, but yeah. Yeah, we're gonna go over to Paddock Islands and chill there. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, 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 I'm sorry if I just am a little crazy this video. It's because I literally had like a 12 hour day. No, I'm kidding, all days are 24 hours, oh my gosh. No, it's because some random lady, I can't even take myself seriously when I'm saying this, but like there was a girl and she literally was up singing karaoke or something really bad karaoke might i add but like singing really bad karaoke until like 3 a.m and i was like i was trying to sleep okay i had school today it's monday by the way if any of you guys are wondering you probably not but if you are it's monday but yeah i was like trying to sleep and this lady was singing i first thought i was like the coyotes because we sometimes hear them where i live and then i was like wait that's not coyotes that's like weird and then i thought it was like a child screaming but then it was like, no. And apparently it was somebody singing. So like that kind of explains how bad she was. But yeah, it was kind of a miserable experience. And I had to close my windows to like block out her singing. And she ended up, I mean, I, my, I, <laughs> I'm like that kid. I'm like that kid. You, you, you could, you do, you, you want. I mean, I, my, I, <laughs> since i ended up like closing my window i ended up overheating in my room so i like didn't sleep well anyway so it was just a very bad night and i'm a little delusional but like when am i not delusional you know but yeah <laughs> um our next response is it's not really that heartwarming but my star stable best friends and i once spent 24 hours talking over the phone about something i really need to get off my chest and i couldn't talk to anybody um, in real life about it. It made me feel so much better and I love her so much. Aww, that's so sweet. Um, most of my star stable friends, um, my good friends have actually quit, which is very sad, but shout out to the ones who are still there and still playing. You guys mean the world to me and so does my club, but it's, it's so heartwarming and so special when 
when somebody um, is there for you in like your hard moments. And my best friend in real life, like I can talk to her about anything and it's, I've had like hard months, hard weeks and just know like things get better and it's just, uh, it just, it just makes you feel so good when somebody, like you can get things off your chest and just trust somebody with like your heart and soul. Like it just, it means a lot. Um, shout out to you. You know who you are, little sheep boy if you're watching this my baby who if you're watching this shout out to you i love you so much okay um our next response was when i was little i always wanted to do horseback riding so i begged my parents and i ended up doing it i'm so glad you're really fighting for something you want to do so i really loved horses when i was little and unicorns especially i think unicorns were up there and i had like unicorn themed everything like my little pony like i <laughs> so much my little honey um i love them so much and i wish i'd started horseback riding way earlier than i did i actually have only been riding for maybe half a year but i or maybe three quarters of a year not exactly sure um probably in all added up half a year once a week because i only ride once a week and it's not even every weekend because i'm so busy all the time so I don't really get to ride every single weekend, but it's actually kind of crazy because I'm at the same level as people who have been riding for like eight or like eight years and that's actually crazy, but I improve pretty well. So it's very fun and I love spending time with all these horses. Like last weekend's lesson was so great. Anyway, let's get back on topic because I'm just going to go off and talk about random stories today because like I said, I got no sleep. Our next response was, it hasn't happened yet, but I'm gonna surprise my star stable best friend at a show she's gonna do. I literally planned any, ever. oh, I literally planned everything with her mother and I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, that's gonna be the best thing ever. I wish I could do that with my star stable friends, but they live so far away from me, like totally different time zones. But yeah, that's gonna be super, super fun. Please let me know how it goes. Um, our next response is when this girl asked me if I was all right because I was drowning my horse. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I mean, at least she cares about your horse, you know, a little less serious than the others. Um, but, but yeah, I love that. She, she totally cares about your horses and who knows, maybe, maybe uh, she has saved your horse's life. He might not have, she or he might not have been here today if, if that girl hadn't stepped in, okay? Just a shout out to her. She's, she's a savior, okay? I cannot even take myself seriously. I, I just can't. Our next response was, my mother could finally lower her dose on the medicine she takes for leukemia. Oh, that's so exciting. Just the little steps are are always like such a big deal, especially in like situations like these um, because I've had like cousins who have been like in the hospital for like a while and it's just like the little things are always the most special and that's that's so exciting for you guys. Um, best of luck to her and her recovery. That that's so ex <laughs> that makes me so happy. Um, our next response is, I absolutely love your art. Keep doing what you're doing. Well, that's not a response, but thanks so much. Um, yeah, I'm really excited because my art has been progressing um, into things I actually call art, I guess now, because I used to, I mean, I've been slowly um, improving over the years and it's finally getting to something where I'm like really happy with. Uh, I, the only issue is I just have to get over art block because I keep having... <laughs> I don't know, I just, I I keep expecting a lot from myself and I don't do the best I could do. Um, I kind of like tend to not do art for a while and just like, I can't do it. But then like, I don't know, art block's a thing everyone, everyone has to struggle through. But yeah, I'm glad you like it, it means a lot. Um, our next response was, um, I think she means, so I'm not very famous, but this girl came up to me and said, oh my gosh, hi, I love you. I died. Oh my gosh. 
It's actually like every single time anyone comes up to me saying how much they love my art, how much they love my videos, anything like that, they love my positivity, whatever. It means so, so much and I like cherish every single person who's ever said anything nice to me because like I, I will read your guys' comments on my videos and like I will be like so happy. Some of you guys say the best things ever and it just makes my day. And this is, this is like the reason I love doing YouTube and art and being like out in the public because there's so many sweet people out there and it's just like, it just, it makes me feel so like, I don't know, just accepted. Like, I don't know. It's just, it's just great. So if you guys take any second to say something sweet to anybody in your life, it like, even if it takes you the shortest amount of time, it will mean so much to them. And yeah, they'll appreciate that for a long time. So thanks if you guys comment stuff. Like if people repeatedly like comment stuff on my Instagram or YouTube, like I'll remember you. So shout out to you guys. Love you. Our next response is my club six month. Oh, that's so exciting. I love like the whole club community. It's so great. Um, if you guys aren't following my club situation, whatever. I've been in the star squad for maybe a year and... How many months? I joined April, May, June, July, August. So we're nearing our one and a half year mark. So wow, that's so exciting. I love them so much and honestly like crazy. Uh, my, they're just the best. <laughs> So yeah, clubs are great. And why is she so why is she so fast? I'm I'm jealous because I'm on like a slug pony right here. Um our next response is once when I was in Star Stable, somebody I saw was getting attacked for something I couldn't help and she started defending me. Later she friended me and to this day is my bestie. This this reminds me a lot like of the other one. Abigail Snow so <laughs> the girl with the fast horse. Hi! Uh, oh my gosh. This reminds me so much though of the one that we read at the very beginning but it's it's you, you always make the best of friends especially like in tough situations so go out be positive girls and i don't know i'm just kind of going crazy but like yeah stand up for people you love and always do the right thing blah 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 so great <laughs> Okay, but now that we've finished talking with her, we're going to continue reading the responses. Our next response is, this random girl from Star Seville sends me videos and photos on Instagram to me and saying like, everything is going to be okay and we all love you. And I have no clue who she is and she's so sweet. Oh my gosh. So there's a lot of people on Instagram, but I think one, one of the people who just comes to mind when I think of like the most positive people I know is Amelia Bravesmith. She she will always make everyone feel super super good and she is also like she'll send so <laughs> this is her logging on. Wow, shout out to you. You read my mind. That's kind of crazy. Um I I guess I have to re-say that cuz I was getting distracted. But yeah, she's super super sweet and she always sends the nicest messages to people. Always makes you feel so much better. Just super great person in general. And she also has a great Instagram feed, so like go ahead and follow her at Amelia Bravesmith. And those people out there always make you feel so good. So I'm so glad there's people like that in the community and even if they don't know you, they just do things um, and take time out of their day to make you feel better and it's just the best thing ever. Okay, we're almost done with our responses, so I think I'm just gonna finish this last race and then we'll be done with the video. Um, here's one that's less, less serious, but when Star Stable closes the chat for no reason, oh my gosh, yes, the most heartwarming moment ever, like, I just, thinking about that makes me tear up a little bit, like, and also Star Stable giving you chat bans, like, how generous can they be? Like, they're just, this, they're just so generous, like, just thinking about that, I just want to, like, send them warm and fuzzy hugs in the mail, like, just, I just love them, I'm kidding, okay, if, if chat, if chat bands could not exist, I would be totally fine. <laughs> um, our last response is, I was thinking I had no friends in my class, but I decided to hang out with a girl and somebody else asked her too. She said she was together with a friend, me, and now we're really good friends. Aw, that's so sweet. I, This is like my second week of school starting this Monday. And I recently just switched in the middle, like not where you normally switch like elementary, middle, middle to high, high to college. I, I didn't switch like that. I switched schools like in the middle of like 
of the grades where nobody switches, I guess. So I was at a private school and I switched to a public school and I was I was nervous that all my friends like at the public school because the public school was where I would originally go and where most of my friends um, from my other grades or other like schools have gone. So I know a lot of people there, but I was scared like since I didn't talk to any of them for like a year, it would be really awkward. But it's been so, so good. And I've had so many friends just like coming up and being like, hi, you're back. Welcome back to the school, whatever. And it's so sweet. I think I've gotten closer with so many more people than if I just continued in the same school like schedule, I guess, if that makes sense. <laughs> the fact that I left and came back just, I think, made me closer with so many more people who I wouldn't like normally talk to. So that makes, that's just like... I'm, I'm super happy with everything that's happened and it's just really great and so yeah even if you're nervous about something just keep an open mind and and yeah things will probably work out so i guess we're finished with all these responses so i'm gonna quickly um finish this race and then i will end the video um also one more thing to add i'm s I don't normally do mushy videos like this, but I thought it was really fun to find to do something a little bit different for once because I really love like all the heartwarming moments that could happen um, that happen in games and in real life. It just makes everyone feel good and I'm sure everyone's stressed with school coming up or if you've already started stressed with all your classes and I think some a video like this would just kind of hopefully calm things down a little bit more and make everyone feel a little bit more happy about life in general i guess thank you guys so much for watching this video was super fun to make i loved all your super sweet responses and honestly i was like tired before this and now i feel just like energized like happy about life you know a little hyper i don't know <laughs> probably not hyper but like just just happy in general and i just love reading things like this and if you want to see more videos like this in the future i will definitely make that happen just you have to let me know but yeah thank you guys so much for watching make sure to like comment and subscribe and click that notification button if you want to know when all my other videos are going to get uploaded also feel free to follow my star stable instagram at luna zebra forest for some more star stable related art and edits bye guys